The Winter Games aren't just about figure skating and ski jumping. Some non-traditional sports are trying to get in on the action. Tonight, Steve Stucker gives shovel racing a try. Guys like New Mexico's John Strader. He races on what he calls modified snow shovels. World champion, 72 miles an hour. World record. Now, I've been sliding on lunch trays, but a shovel? Isn't that a little weird? Extreme, perhaps? Is it as much fun as it looks like? It's such a blast. If you've ever liked to sled or do anything like that, I mean, it, it's like the ultimate rush. So, of course, I asked the guys to show me how it's done. Like, God, like hook your man. feet right there. Okay. So that way, you be... And then this, this, is steer? this is your steering right there. So what you do is you're, to... You're kidding me. No, that's... that's <laughs> you go side. down a mountain on this thing? <laughs> Had you been drinking heavily when you came up with this idea? <laughs> Actually, the maintenance guys at ski areas are the brains behind shovel racing. And lift operators, at the very end of the day, uh, the chairlifts were very, very slow, and they'd keep the, the, the ski areas open till dark. And so these guys would, like, ride the chairlift down, freezing to death, and so they just finally started riding their shovels down the hill because it was much, much faster. Interesting. So where are the brakes on this thing, anyway? When you're ready to stop, feet out, use your hands, pull the shovel out, and then just slide. Got it. <laughs> So if you feel like you're losing control or you're going too fast, lay back. Sounds pretty scientific. It's like we call it the dead man position. <laughs> the dead man? <laughs> okay, well, maybe I'm getting cold feet. Or is that just the wind chill up here? Well, too late to back out now. <laughs> More like no brains. <laughs> Let's try that bad boy again. Here we go, you guys actually have hopes of someday getting this in as an Olympic competition. We think this is probably one of the most exciting wild action sports uh, in winter sports. It seems like as much a winter sport as some of the other questionable events. Three, hard, oh, not. oh, real hard. Ah, fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. 14 days of curling in the Olympics. 14 <laughs> days. And they'll probably get two minutes of TV exposure. I mean, I, I, it makes no sense to me why something as boring as that would be an Olympic sport when something as exciting as this is not even considered. And, of course, some of the shovel racers spend thousands of dollars souping up their sleds to make them ultra-high-tech and ultra-fast. This That's goes faster position. than the shovel did? Yeah, this uh, last year was uh, oh. 76 miles an hour. Uh, Over 70 miles per hour? I mean, that sounds like rush hour through the construction zones. <laughs> Not sure if I'm ready for that, but it's the moment of truth. Time for me to step up a classification here. Let it rip! Let it rip! Hey, not too bad! Steve Stucker, eyewitness news 4! That oh, big coward. No kidding. Oh, Jeez. Disappointed. Yeah.